I know Ubisoft hasn't been exactly playing in our uh, courtyard lately with their new game announcements and games overall, but Tom Clancy's X Defiant, I think it's on a whole new planet. They missed Earth and either went to Mars or further. Okay, now, I will grant the game this. It might, it could, could be a good game. Could be a good game. Anyway, well, the new game, Tom Clancy's X Defiant, was revealed this, well, a few hours ago. And were you excited for the reveal? I mean, who wasn't excited for a reveal of a new Tom Clancy game? Oh yeah. Uh, I mean, I was like, I want to see a new game, sure. I mean, it's Tom Clancy, I've played a few of those. I like Breakpoint, uh, Wildlands, uh, Future Soldier, and some of those other uh, single player ones. Uh, I have tried the uh, Splinter Cell games, never really gotten into those. Uh, I'm planning to try to get into those again. And I'm also try gonna try though some of the Tom Clancy games I have not tried. I think I own basically all of them on Ubisoft store. But, uh, oof. I was kind of excited for seeing what they, if they had actually listened to the players to the community and actually started making a new splinter cell game well uh, oh this is so exciting it's almost here only 20 minutes to go 20 minutes or 22 minutes go 22 minutes oh this is so exciting these pictures are weird, man. What a weird artist drew this for Tom Clancy. Oh well, I'm sure the game is great. 21 minutes and 40 seconds. 39. Ooh, less than 10 minutes left. Ooh, there's a cat riding a rat and it says taxi on the rat what the hell am i looking at i didn't notice that one before what do these pictures have to do with tom clancy oh well oh something has me uh nope still counting down I wonder what that weird... Oh, wait, that woman, she has, she has those glasses! She has those glasses! Ooh, maybe it's a splinter cell! Ooh, only 7 minutes and 42 seconds! Ooh, 39! It's so close now! 5, 4, 3, 2, 1! What do those colorful pictures have to do with Tom Clancy? Oh. Oh.
Okay, maybe my disappointment with the announcement isn't that big, but uh, it was still a kind of a disappointment for me. Uh, to explain the game here, it's a free-to-play, fast-paced arena shooter that combines combines intense gunplay with personalized loadouts and specialized factions as teams of gunfighters called Defiance battle for domination. <sighs> Come play with us, register now for a chance to pay, play early and receive the latest news. Oh, I actually did that. I did register, so yeah. Uh, I mean, I get to play for free, so why not at least try it before it's released? Well, hopefully I get to try it at least. Um, I mean, I can manage to suffer through it. Uh, for you guys to upload, hopefully. Uh, now, who knows, I might not suffer too much, I might just enjoy it, but... Yeah. Mm. Let's see what the game says. Well, Ubisoft themselves say about the game. Personalize playstyle. Personalize your Defiant to play to match your playstyle. Choose your faction, traits, abilities, and ultras. Select from an arsenal of primary and secondary weapons, attachments, and a device to complete your loadout. Then, tw then tweak it on the fly to adapt to an ever-changing battlefield. Competitive clashes. Tom Clancy's X Defiant offers a variety of competitive 6 vs 6 arena and linear game modes such as Domination and Escort. Combine that with a large pool of uniquely designed maps in rotation and no two matches will feel the same. I believe it when I see it. Diverse factions of Defiance. Wolves, Outcast, Cleaners, and Echelon factions battling across iconic locations just the starting point. We'll keep adding to our cast of Defiance as the game evolves, drawing a range of characters, drawing on a range of characters and abilities from the Tom Clancy universe and beyond. Beyond is the word I can't imagine. Well I mean does this sound bad? No, it really doesn't sound bad. But does it sound like a Tom Clancy game? I mean, I'm not big on... I haven't read any Tom Clancy books, I'll be honest. Uh, I'll be very honest about that. Uh, I have played some of the Tom Clancy games, not many of them. Uh, certainly not all of them, and certainly not even half of them that, well, that Ubisoft has released. But I can't imagine PvP, a free-to-play PvP F FPS game is what Tom Clancy fans and the community in Tom Clancy games were asking for or even wanting or even thinking of. Well, they were probably dreaming about it in their nightmares, maybe, but... I doubt this is what they were looking for. Now I will say this, uh, Ubisoft has some, I would say almost balls <laughs> to actually reveal something like this, especially considering how much we heard or when you hear Tom Clancy and you sp sp talk about that to fans of the series, all they want to hear is that a new Splinter Cell is coming. And here we get pretty much the op uh, opposite. Gotta hand it to Ubisoft. They know how to, uh, well, stir up the community. Uh, actually, when looking at the uh, trailers and such, it is a little bit uh, uh, divided. We see worldwide reveal 1.6 likes, 1.5 dislikes, uh, pretty much the same on the developer interview, so that's kind of interesting actually. I'm not gonna say this game has to be bad or will be bad, but I do have certain restrictions 
against or certain yeah restrictions would be the word. I am very skeptic about this game. Now it's free to play, so that will mean microtransactions. Knowing Ubisoft, it could be anything, honestly. Uh, I mean, they already have cosmetic items in their full $60 games. So in a free to play games, what could we see there? See there, uh, maybe pay to win, but I don't think they're gonna do any pay to win. Well, I hope not. But at least that's my take on this. What's your take on this? Have you seen the trailer? What are your thoughts about it? Are you a Tom Clancy fan? And what was your reaction to this? Anyway, that's all for me. I've been Swip92. Have a great life and I hope to see you in future videos. Bye bye.